what's up YouTube uh, Jazoo here uh, Game Hero Kiri um, I'm gonna show you my current uh, Glad deck it's Forbidden Glads with uh, triple veilers I've um, been playing it for uh, a little over a week now and it's been unbelievably good I haven't lost a single match yet against you know, all top tier decks just a whole span of stuff at locals so um, here we go. Monster count is 13. Really low, but necessary. Uh, star 1, bestie. Staple card. Uh, 1 hop. Staple card. Uh, 1 ready Ari. Staple card. All the monsters are pretty much just staple cards. There's only one tech card in here. 1 Darius. 2 Lacori. Trying to get the supers. So if anyone has supers for sale, for cheap, I'll pay 25 each on them. So, if anyone has them, let me know. I'll hit you up. Uh, double quest. Uh, tech and Sam Knight right now. Um, it was either him or Octavius for the tech card, and I went with Sam Knight because it's more reliable and it's actually really cool. And plus, it's a level 3, so when uh, some good rank 3 exceeds come out, this guy will be more useful. Um, Sam and Ramillo, just one. Also, level 3 for exceeds. Um, triple Veilers. Busted as hell. It's like a staple card in any deck right now. Not three, but Valor in general. At least one, but most people are running two. Um, I'm running three because it just stops so much stuff, and I need to draw it with this deck. So, um, eight out of ten times, Valor goes off on turn one. Um, I'd also say um, about thirty or forty percent of the time, my Valors are just used to go into synchros because the chalices and lances in here stop, and chariots stop everything else from happening. Um, spells, triple chair, uh, proving ground, staple, uh, book of moons, staple, true nade instead of double MSTs. Um, it gives me one less um, card in the deck, making it 41, I believe, right now. And true nade is just better. I side the MSTs for decks that I know I have to blow back rows. Monster Reborn, Staple, Triple Chalices, um, all ulti. Uh, really good, really good cards, man. Uh, they've been doing me a lot of shit. Um, and those, of course, combo with the three Forbidden Lance, which stops so much stuff from happening. Um, and then just Dark Hole, of course. Um, traps. Triple Chariot. Uh, to give him. Um, why would you not want to play Triple Chariot in a format like this one? Um, so, Triple Chariot, Triple D Prison. Just <laughs> such a good card. Very versatile. Um, stops a lot of stuff from happening. Double Seven Tools. Pretty much a staple in any build right now that wants to actually like win. Um, double Warnings. Staple on everything. Mirror Force is pretty much a staple card and everything. Uh, I'm running two bottomless right now instead of torrential. Uh, yeah, it gives me it open it adds one more slot, but um, it's another it's a chance to draw into another one and it's it's more useful to me. I bought a uh, torrential. I just side with this deck. It's not that big of a deal to have torrential with the Gladiator Beasts. Uh, I'm playing double compulse right now. Um, but from what I was hearing about Nationals and my friends that were there talking about it and shit, um, Blackhorn of Heaven was the tech card of the weekend. Um, so I'm probably going to pick up two ultimate um, Blackhorn of Heavens for this deck instead of the Compose, which would be a lot more useful in a way. It's just another negation. And then Judgment. I mean, who the fuck might want to run Judgment? Side, two Cybers. Um, you know, against all the machine junk and just. This is a good um, beater. DD Crows, too. Really good card. I'm going to put a third one in. Double Puppet Plant. Really good cards out here. Um, two Penguin Soldier. Really, really good side card right now. Base and main those. Uh, double MSTs in the side. Don't need to main them, so. They're just there, just in case. Two Noblemans. Just in case. Torrentials there just in case. Um, so, most things it's like it's plants and samurai and stuff that just get fuels going quickly. There's a librarian shit. One dust. 
against back row heavy decks and gravekeepers, and then change his appearance for a lot of stuff. So that's a side uh, extra two Gazarius staple, pretty much in any Glad deck. Two Sedidaries right now. I used to run three, but it's just really excessive and it just clogged a spot. Um, so just two, two Heraclinos. Two secret ones finally. Got them for like five bucks from someone. Ameritech. Um, Mist Worm. I like more than Trishula in the Glad Beast deck because I want to reset a lot of stuff and I have a lot of removal power already. Um, I have a Trishula in my Samurai right now. so. But in this one, I play the Mist Worm instead. Brio. Staple card. Colossal, pretty much a stable card with his warriors going around. Actually, the heroes, Black Rose, stable card. Stardust, stable card. Cataster, just a stable card. Ancient Fairy, uh, it's a pretty good synchro right now. And then Hope, 39. Um, oh, Utopia, I mean. Uh, pretty much the only seed out right now that's useful. Um, so yeah, that's the build. Uh, feel free to rate, subscribe, comment, etc. Um, to the team. And to just comment on the deck and stuff. Suggestions and whatever. But yeah, that's it. Uh, that's what I've been playing at Locals lately. And I've never, haven't lost a single match. I've just been winning everything. Um, but yeah, can't wait to bring it into regionals when the season starts up. See what happens. Peace out, guys.